Hey there lads and lasses, this is that Ryan guy, and welcome back to my let's play of Amnesia, a machine for pigs. In the last part we uh, wandered around the manor looking for my stupid kids some more, found some hidden passageways, pulled some levers, turned some knobs, made some bits go spinny spinny, and then... What? The bloody hell was that? Why is this door open? Why... Hands are bleeding. Raw. Is scrub, something scrub, the smell happening? How can I hold my children with these hands now? How can I kiss them goodnight with lips that have issued such instruction? Okay, guy, we know that you're a jackass. And it's not like you cared about them to begin with. Notes. Oh, Sally of the Dolls Cottager. Oh, she come a snuffling by night round your door, with her pretty apron right down to the hoof. And her ringlets are fair and her eyes china blue, like a half buried hand in the wintry snow. Like a hand in the wintry snow. And she'll beg you for apples through the winter ajar, window ajar. Her face be all hidden, but her eyes shine a flame. And though you be tempted, her bosom so fair, she'll snatch you and catch you and eat out your heart, oh, she'll snatch you and catch you and eat out your heart. So look to your manners come the eve of the year, lest Sally comes calling for apples, my dear, and know that some doors never should open wide. Never should open wide. Take heed to your father and keep him safe inside. Disobedient children make Sally her peace, her pies, oh, and warm Sally's beastly insides. Ah, uh, what? That's a delightful little poem. Oh, my drinks. Come to me, my drink. I can't. <sighs> Why can I pick up no alcohols in this entire godforsaken manner? Oh, I don't like that whatever was being... Whatever's in my room has just been drugged out into the hallway here and through the open passage unto what? Unto what, I say? Missing something here? So we have a door that was once open but now is not. We have a well that I haven't the strength to properly pump. We have. That's really about it. Let's go this way. I saw some blood. I'm really hoping the monster aren't about to appear because I haven't actually seen a single hidey hole yet. And that leaves me feeling more than a little bit concerned for my well being. Is this. Is this. Where, where does this. Who the hell's I been sneaking cry. around changing my teeth around? The way home. I will have none. I will have none at all. You're a liar, sir, and you know it. Oh, good. Here we go to the machine room where all the horrors are. No. Out. Oh, I've been here. Oh. Okay. Right. Right. So where's that piggy? There's no piggy there now. I'm fine with that. Let me run, you stupid whiny kids. Where are you? 
Where are you even hiding? No candies? This game is sorely lacking in candy. Things to pick up, things to play with, things to touch and molest with a graceful, caring hand. Quiet, madam. Your fate is not my concern. It's my children's safety is at stake right now, so... Maybe if I just hide in here, the uh, driver won't notice me and he'll just take me away from this nasty place. Yeah, probably not, huh? All right, Piggy Max. You dumb disappointments. That's not an egg. A stone egg is called a rock. What? Oh, do we have the black mold? That's not good. Ah, ow, ow! Against the rising waters, curled into his cabin, he barely noticed the passing weeks. The swell nearly sunk her, but his fever kept it afloat. In the dark, his song glowing. Okay. Oh, where the hell am I? in the cellar? Am I in the wine cellar? Ooh, I hope I'm in the wine cellar. I don't even care that the stairs are broken. If I'm... I am... Oh, why can't I drink you? You big vats of delicious memory blocking wonder. Right, lantern. <sighs> Well, I'm not getting back up that way. Come on, slow coach. It's this way. Slow coach? What'd you call me? All right. The shaking ground you feel is our attempts to clear the floodwaters. Treachery, Mandas. We were undone. Your children are trapped by this act. You must find them before it is too late. What do you need me to do? How can I find them? Always deep, Amandus. Through the piston room and into the tunnels. Then find the bilge and flush the rotten water. I will help you where I can. But you must be swift, my little friend. Why am I even listening to you, crazy person who I don't know? My children were literally just in this corridor. I saw them walk down this path. Well, okay, that's technically a lie, but I'm pretty sure that's the way they went. Based entirely on hunches and object permanence. That is... You know, I could just tell this guy to stop making the earthquakes. I think that be beneficial to the entire damn house just not falling down around us. But no, I'm... Hello? Why can I not pick you up or throw you or anything? running in my walkways. It's not safe. Slow the ass butts down. Uh, 
Okay, well that's just nothing to do. Door jammed. I can hide it up. Oh, come on, seriously, I could lift that. Get my hand there, push it right off. Were it not for the fact that there's another one on the other side. But we're ignoring that for now. What are these? Is, is this seriously the extent of this fetch quest? Do you work now? You do! Hooray! Really, I just like the sound of the industrial grind. Metal on metal. It's my jam. The machine doesn't even actually have a real purpose. It just makes all those funky sounds that I enjoy so much. So, oh, why did you pull? Why did you spin that wheel? Because it was there. I'll take this battery with me, just in case. I may be able to use it as a uh, weapon. If necessary. Improvise weapon. The steam's all going over there. Excellent. Yay, I opened the door. Open the portcullis. Which now closes behind me because why wouldn't it? No? Okay. Children, I'm coming for you. Bad. You know what you've done. Small bones in the orchard. I have it's time to, to make things right. Damn this wretched soul. I am given birth to nothing but machinery. Oh, buddy. That's probably not even true. Can I pull you? I really don't want to open that when I'm still up here because, you know, physics, violence. Come down, my barrels. I have need of you. Whoa. Ow, ow, ow. Stop. Is there anywhere else I can go before examining the barrel... Barreler? There is not. Alright. Off to the storage chambers I go. Provided I can... actually manage to do so. I guess I still am a bit inebriated from last night's get together. Me and 16 bottles. levers, throw all the switches, make all the machines come to life. Whir, 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 twist, twist, twist. So I'm really confused about what exactly the machine is supposed to be doing all this, because I got the initial impression that the whole point of whatever it was that I was doing here was a better way to butcher pigs. That isn't sounding like it's the case to go along. I mean, efficient butchery is one thing. But this all sounds 
positively malevolent. No matter how much of an oxymoron that might be. Do I go by that from that side? I do not. Okay. Oh, hey, come here. Come here. Children! from me forever. There we go. The hell was that even? <sighs> okay. I'll just reinforce the beam. Alright, that I can live with. Children. Oh, what's this way? More pastures I cannot get through. And another broken machine. I knew he'd come in handy. What? Well, that's not my machine. I know my machines. Ah! 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 What the? Oh God! Damn it! Where did my thing go? I, I get the intent of, you know, making things all spooky sounding, but seriously, I just had... Oh, you son of a bitch. How did you get down there? I am less than enthused by this development. And yeah, okay, scary piggy things. <gasps> I see you. Come with me, my candy. Don't you dare leave my sight. Alright. You go there. Broken one. I don't give a crap. Get into your new home. Kajunk! No, fully kajunk. Alright, that's wide open. Was there anything else in there I didn't catch? We have to go through the entire pathway, so. This just takes me down to. A note! August 19th, 1899. Von Reichenbach writes to the Odic Force, whilst that ignorant Charlton Blavatsky pontificated upon the soul. They are both cretins. To think one can strive for such great heights without wading first through puke and innard, without standing upon an architecture of, lie, of lies of bones. Montezuma was the wiser. But here, in our temples of steel, I have witnessed the severed head of a man recently trampled to death by a runaway carriage immersed in the solution of the Brennenberg compound upon his eyes, and cry, Oh, where are my legs, sir? Where is my body? We are breaking through the barriers of death itself. Oh, my dead darling Lily, it is too late for you, but I promise you this. I will save our children from death, and, if need be, I'll wrench them back from the blackness with this wonderful concoction. The Brennenberg comp- Oh, f Fuck, this guy is doing all the stuff from Amnesia. But he's doing it big.
Holy crap, I am strong! I'm taking this thing with me. Because seriously, if I can one hand like a 2 x 4 of that size, there's literally nothing I can't do. Except walk with any manner of haste. God damn it. All right. Piggy, shut up! Don't think that you're not going to be next on my list. I will murder you. And stuff you... What the hell? Is that a kid? Oh, child! Yeah, I don't know how well I can trust you, given you're supposed to be, you know, missing or trapped down in the belly of this beast somewhere. But whatever, I've got no better leads, and my hallucinations have helped me in the past, so why not? How else do you think I come up with this whole contraption? Hold still, for God's sake, hold still, child. Don't let it get into your eyes. I'm gonna rinse it out now. There. What? You will be fine. You just need to lie down. Enoch, look to your what? mother. How many times have I told you not to play in the cellar? Oh, I think that we're way over the uh, time limit here, so I think I'm going to end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, feel free to like, comment, or subscribe, and I shall catch you in the next part. Cheers!